It's Naya, straight out of Clarksville, Mississippi, and you watching. Shit, I ain't asked for a handout. I'ma get my time, cause I ain't hating that bitch. I got a boss up, cause I ain't taking no loss. Uh -huh. Bitch, I be humble, that's why they can't stop me. I uh -huh. guess it's a reason that I'm overlooked. Not giving too much, so stay tuned for no hook, bitch. What got me into making music is I was, like, always in, like, a messed up state of mind when I was younger. And one of my friend girls, she just told me to, you know, put my, my um, thoughts on a piece of paper, and I've been doing it since. So what was the first song that you wrote? Honestly, I can't even tell you. So was it? Was it I just used to do little freestyles and stuff like that. So spit song that you first wrote, like that you first put out. Bullshit, <laughs> <laughs> bullshit. <laughs> like I can let uh uh. That's definitely not me. Now I wouldn't even embarrass myself like that. Nah. So what uh what are some other female artists that you used to listen to or that you listen to still? Uh, Gangsta Boo, Lil Chad. Um, Doja Cat, I like Meg, Cardi B, um, and my favorite, uh, Juicy Fruit. Oh, yeah, okay. You don't fool with Nicki Minaj? I mean, I, I fuck with Nicki Minaj. That's my girl. You say I need your friend. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you trying to make her mad. Don't try to piss her off. Don't try to piss off my girl. But I, I do fuck with Nicki Minaj, though, but at this, this generation in time, like. Not right now. But, so back in like uh, 2011, 2011 2009, she she had it. She had the game on lockdown, you know, and she still forever got the title. But no, she ain't got, no, nah, she ain't got the, the I don't that. like that. Ain't nobody got it. I, don't, I think it's going tit for tat now to me. <laughs> your, your song, Lucky, got 18K views. Talk about the uh, the hype behind that song. Yeah, okay, so basically I was mad as hell, and basically I was just like, this shit can get ugly, little bitch, you better be looking, and it just came to me, shit, uh, but the um, I didn't expect the song to make 18K because that was the second song that I had put out, okay. and I wasn't even putting it out for, you know, like. So that was the second song that you ever put out to the public? Yeah. Yeah, I, people liked it, but you know, I think myself, I think that it's, it's different stuff that I could have did in most of my videos back in the gap, you know, that I feel like should have been changed or done better or whatever the case may be. But you know, it's a process. I'm still learning. You got a song called Female Goat. Yeah, I got a song. I think Washing Cars or something like that. Um, I song? didn't get that out from nowhere I just it was the cheapest idea <laughs> it was the cheapest rap yeah I was like shit I'm just gonna put the water some soap and bitches everybody got some shorts let's go so talk about some of the other uh, female artists that you work with locally locally I only work with my, my bitch Shania the baller okay that's the only female artist that yes okay, that's the okay. only female artist I work with uh, y'all have any songs together? Yeah, not out physically not yet, out. but it's coming. Okay. Like, stay tuned. My life growing up, it was not so good, but you wouldn't even be able to tell that shit when you look at me. I don't let the past define who yeah. I am today. So I got a question. If it's off the wall, do you feel like what Jada Pickett did, what Jada Smith did to Will Smith and Bryce? I don't think with Jada... <laughs> Damn, is you saying this because I'm a Virgo? Yeah, that's my opinion. Oh, man. Okay, look. I don't think what she did was right. Jada, another type of Virgo, because I think she an August because I'm a September. Yeah. So you feel like we should skip over the month of August and September then? Since y'all Virgo. Uh-uh, no. Uh-uh, Virgo's the best sign in the world. <laughs> what you turn back? Juicy Fruit. <laughs> Juicy <laughs> Fruit so underrated. Them. I know, that ain't neat, but I'm just I'm saying, saying like, as a right now top head, yeah, definitely Juicy Fruit. So what do you think your city can do better to progress musically? Shit, support us, the local rappers. The local rap, they be supporting everybody from everywhere else. And then be having so many comments. <laughs> When it comes to they be having so many comments about, you know, other people and all this and that. Oh, she should have got signed, blah, 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 blah. But it's people in, in the town right here that hard, just as hard, you know. Okay. The music industry didn't taught me that don't trust nobody. This merch just...
Can I say it? Yeah. Okay. The music industry really fucked up. Like, they don't look at real talent no more. They just put titties and ass on the bitch and boom, they go a rapper right there. But, you know, while the rest of us, you know, sit back here and suffer, you know, you got the bitches over here yeah, that ain't even a rapper or don't even want to really be a rapper, you know, and they over here and they on the stage turn as fuck. They just making, making rappers now and it ain't real no more how it used to be back in the day. I should have been born in the 90s. <laughs> yeah, shout out to my bestie Shanae the baller. Shout out to uh the the local artists in my town that fuck with me and I fuck with you back. Uh shout out to Mississippi period. Any artist in Mississippi, shout out to you. The fuck cause no. it's us over anything to me. No. My inspiring message to the people that look up to me or that wanna do music or anything is to not let nobody change who you are because at the end of the day, you know, like you coming into this stuff, if you, you know, push your way to get there, you you was pushing yourself to get there being yourself and don't let, don't never let nobody change you or don't ever second guess yourself or downplay yourself for nobody. Girl, this game is harder for us, so put your motherfucking big girl panties on and keep going. <laughs> it's hard. You been tuned in with East Naya. And you've been rocking with the day bird.